Hello, welcome back. Last time I got down to one single puzzle left to do uh, that I can access, and then maybe one more up here. And I took a look at it and kind of got an idea of what's going on. This shouldn't be too much of a problem, but you can never really be sure about these things. So, here. Technicolor. Some kind of, like, old brand or something for... Uh, is that still around? I don't know. It was like a word that I would see on old VHS tapes when they're, uh, you know, something. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> apparently I don't really know very well what it is. Uh, anyway, so, uh, this needs to become a roller and go there, which opens the way to the thing that I put a cyan bean on to get to the exit. It also gives me access to two more beans. I had a thought that I need to think a little more about what these two beans are for, um, but anyway, this needs to turn into a cloud to zap the roller because nobody else can do it. The main problem that I had, so yeah, sure, uh, I was doing that by putting a vine here and feeding it a bean. Vine recipe is always green. I was just feeding it one, I think. So my red was turning into a bucket. My white wasn't doing anything. My cyan was turning into a bomb. I don't know, here-ish. Was I doing it like this? You got a bucket. Oh right, and you need to be a cloud. I need to be a... Okay, I guess I'll put that down. You need to be a cloud, you need to be a bomb. So you can blow up that vine. Main problem with that is I would love you to zap right on this turn so that this would spawn, but you're not going to do that. Well, since I'm doing nothing with this white bean... I'm doing something with the white bean. I'm putting it in the bucket and then the cloud gets stuck on it. So a bucket on its own does not... Uh... See, what's suspicious to me here is that I can get most of my work done right now. But only most of it. Yeah, a bucket on its own does not change the cloud's evaluation of whether it can zap in that direction. It seems to me like that cl uh, cloud is going to have to do a lot of work. So hang on, what was the problem with just... Uh, Blowing up this... Right, and the cloud can do the work of spawning that bomb for me, if I want it to. What exactly was the problem? With just blowing this up right now, and then taking the time that it takes to use a bean, could be green, could be white, could be anything, to go down here and just do this twice. Uh, so the roller is spawned, the bucket is moving, I can have my white bean back. Do I have a problem with what this bucket is doing? I want this white bean to like turn cyan and uh... be picked up by the bucket. Wait, am I almost done already? Hold on. So my roller spawns. And that's cool. I can have this bean. And that's cool. Can I put it in the right place? I can. Bucket's still alive. Hold on. Am I basically done already? Ah, uh, this vine's not gonna blow up. A second time. Because I don't have access to... Ah, okay. Um... Hmm. Okay, got several thoughts here. So yeah, an issue I have is I don't think I can have that roller see me without losing the bucket. I'm wrong. That timing works fine. Wait, am I done? Hold on, so these beans... Right, I can't get to those beans, but that's okay. I don't need them, do I? Um... I might. 
So I want the vine to blow up when a cyan bean is here on that. Cyan bean, you say? I only had the one. So hang on, I feel like I somehow magically got further than I was before. Only recipes that exist right now are vine and roller. And I don't have an orange bean. I'm gonna have to spawn that vine, thereby removing the roller recipe. Ah, the vine's tendril can block the bucket. How's that sound? Sounds great to me. Um, how does the timing work out if I get these first? It doesn't. Okay, so I want to do this at such a time when it's going to block the bucket. Uh, I got zapped. I could do that a turn later and maybe not. A couple of turns later. That doesn't affect the timing of the zap. I'll still get zapped. I'll still get zapped. Okay, so that's an issue. I could relocate the vine. That's an option. I can't blow it up right now. I can't make a roller or anything right now, and I get zapped if I do that. Okay, so I'm stuck getting zapped right now. That is my current problem. Got a couple of them, actually. What I'd like to do is get over here with these beans. Well, the vine is somehow distracted. Uh, hold on, I start with a cyan bean, right? I do. And that's the one that turns into the bomb that blows up the vine the first time. Do I have any interest in... See, that bucket can kind of just be in whatever column. It could be over here. Yeah, vine going the other way. That sounds way healthier. I have an orange... I don't have an orange bean. There's the one that the roller is made of. Well, I could maybe... Hmm, can maybe make a second one? Wait, am I not doing that already anyway? Okay, so let's try some stuff. Already got an idea of what I want to do here. Yeah, so I think I'm switching sides with the vine. That sounds pretty good. The layout I had before looked approximately like this. But instead, if I'm switching sides with the vine, I'm going to want this instead. Which is fine. Everything still works out that way. I should stand here when I do that. Uh, Alright, oh so you need to exist. That exists now. I had a bean that I meant to put down that I did not. How do I want that bean to end? on the roller space so that I get an orange back from the vine and cre create a roller? Wait, why do I want that? Uh, I don't know. Let's find out. Doesn't seem any better or worse than having another white. Although having, if I have two of the same one, then I can... No, nothing is white. Well, the roller would be then because the, the no color change would happen. I'd have a white and be able to make a roller. That's the same thing, because I was able to make a roller anyway, right? Okay, so uh, if we do this and I don't blow up the vine right away, I let it do a little bit more work first. Uh, it should be fine, I think. So I do want to stop you when that is orange. Sounds right. Now the bucket being there does change some timings relative to that and some other things. This might make things worse. Okay, but anyway, my current task is to spawn a roller though. These beans are the wrong color. I needed one that was not a color that is anything because that needs to get zapped by the cloud and not turn into something. Well, or I could actually just make a roller and not use the bucket for what I was going to use it for. I mean, okay, let's uh, see where that would lead. 
Okay, you're another roller now. Got two of them. Uh, I'll assume you're fine there. Got a green in my pocket. Don't have a cyan, need to make one, and that's the end of the puzzle, isn't it? Wait, am I done? I look suspiciously done. Uh, bomb is an issue. I need an orange to get a bomb. Okay, and I'm not gonna have one. You can't give me yours, can you? The vine could eat you. But that won't get it to me. So basically, I have a yellow so I can make a bucket. I have a white which can't make anything. Now that bucket could have been in this column, which wouldn't have gotten me a cyan bean unless I'm like switching sides of the vine again and blowing it up again. I'm kind of running out of beans for that sort of thing, but maybe you can give me one back or something. So the bucket being here is good because it could eventually collect a cyan bean that was left there by a vine that was dragging it and got blown up. That would be ideal. If the vine's on the other side and gets blown up while the bean is here... Yeah, I might have to switch sides with the vine a second time, but can I make that many explosions? Maybe I needed to spawn more bombs during the first bit of that process. I don't know, that doesn't seem like it would quite do the job. Um... I feel like I'm getting somewhere, but I'm not there yet. So yeah, a bucket could deposit something on the cloud space or on the bomb space. There could have been a time when I had two whites? No, because I made a roller out of an extra orange, and that was how I... Well, yeah, I could have had two whites instead, but then this bucket would be moving, which is kind of a pain. Okay, what am I trying to do? Mostly blow up this vine. Which, at this time, I would need an orange bean, and I don't have one. And I can't really get one as far as I can see. I don't want to eat you with a vine or anything. While that'd be possible, and I could eat the other roller too and get their beans back, I wouldn't uh, be able to get in here to put down the thing. Okay, if I had a cyan bean right now, it'd be over. To get a cyan bean, a vine needs to either pull it from here to here and get bucketed, or pull it from here to here and get bucketed. And to get bucketed, the vine has to blow up. To blow up, I need another bomb. I need another bomb. That's kind of the situation. I need another bomb. And bomb colors just are not really with me. I really had no beans to spare during that process, except the white one that could go in front of the cloud and then get out from in front of the cloud. Bucket would be moving up and down, which is kind of a pain, but maybe that's fine. I think the bucket does go in this column. So I could have done the same thing with the bucket in that column. Maintaining my ability to... Ah... To put something there, but I don't have two of something. Okay, well, I could have had two of something. Alright, so... Trying again. Red here. White will be here. I won't use it yet. Red here. Cyan here. Green here. Spawn that. Spawn that. Uh, spawn uh, 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 this. That gets spawned, and I blow you up now. Gonna do this shuffle. I 
now that bucket is around and moving, but that's fine. Okay, so I now have a white bean and I can have another of the same color and it can turn into a bomb. That sounds pretty good. Okay, I'll just leave you here for now. I'll deal with you later. Uh, I need that roller to see me, which I do have just enough time to do. Without losing my bucket. I can get around to the other side without losing my bucket. Um, what I can't do... Okay, I can, I'm going to lose the bucket now. I'll have to make another one. That's fine, I think. Yeah, that should be workable. So I have a bomb recipe now. I have the capability to blow up this vine. Hmm. Couple of problems. Oh, note. If the vine's on the left, it can't be blown up by a bomb that's moving horizontally. So I'd do it vertically, I guess. Okay, well, that's, that's not too much of a problem. There's a very handy wall here. Maybe I'm only moving left to right? So, if I'm only moving left to right, then no cyan is being created. Maybe I'm not only moving left to right. Okay, so if I were to switch sides with the vine right now... and have already created a bucket. <sighs> See, here's the thing. I need to create a bomb. And that bomb's gonna have nothing to bounce against. That will destroy the vine. Okay, so other than that, do I have all my, let's see, yeah, so so what's what else can't I do on this route? Or is that the only thing? I'm going to create a bucket here eventually. That will be made out of this bean. And then if I could blow you up right now... I wouldn't quite be done because there's no cloud barrier there and I couldn't take my cyan bean across. And I wouldn't end up with anything that would help me with that. Okay, so I do have one more problem after that point. But also I have the problem that I can't detonate this bomb in that spot. Unless, like, I'd involve the bucket and then it's moving on the wrong axis. I can't really spawn the bomb early because then it's too close to the vine and it would get eaten instead of the beans. Ah, here's a solution for that problem. Whoops, bump the bomb against the vine's arm. Okay, so that's one problem solved. Still a few remaining, but that is one problem solved. Uh, I didn't spawn that bomb. Okay, so this is very close. But it's off by a little bit. Oh, ah, no, that's not exactly a problem. I can do this and lose my bucket and get that out. Okay. So now... Now I just can't get over here. That is my single remaining problem. And these two beans... Don't appear like they can help me solve that. Right, because I have no beans on the right. Could I have left one? I don't think so. I used them all for various purposes. Could that bucket... Yeah, a bucket could have put my vine bean there to eat the cloud. Let's do that. Yeah, a bucket didn't need to be where I put it. It could be a little more south, which would help. I think I'm done. 
I think I have a solution for everything now. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Mm, okay, I'm just gonna have to change sides carefully at the right time. That should be fine. I don't think I need to be in this region anymore after uh, after that cloud gets eaten. Uh, okay, so what's the sequence of events? I do this. I make that bucket. I get over here. I blow you up right now. I have just enough time for all this. I want to place a green bean down here. Yeah, I think I'm done. Uh, it's going to make the vine. So I got kind of a little time limit here. Um, let's make sure you have another toy to play with and not mess with me. Oh, geez. Okay, it's fine. No, you're messing with me. Uh, I could put that toy a little farther south. Uh, okay. So yeah, put a put a bean in a in a cloud spot, and then that's that's gonna happen. Uh, oh geez, I don't have the. I might have the ability to no no not quite. Um, I think I can work this out. It's just, there's like some weird interaction between things here. Can I do, maybe this is enough time. Uh, maybe this is enough time. Ah, you grab the yellow. Sure, that works. Okay. Okay, and you're even a vine shield. There we go. There we go. I think I'm done. Cool. That was fun. Interesting puzzle. Kind of felt different from a lot of the others. Not sure why I say that, but I don't know. Just just had a had a vibe that was not, not the same as what I'm used to here. Alright, final book is this one, I think. To whoever finds this. If you have made it this far, you must have learned a lot about the tradition of the beans. You will be able to come to our island after solving the puzzle in the next room. Perhaps afterwards you'd like to stay a while and work with us. You will have to ask your parents, of course. You're assuming I'm young, I guess. Okay, sure. How do they know about me? Have the Has the bunny been reporting back this whole time? And like, I've been here for a week or whatever, and uh, bunnies told them about me... And that's why they, like, had this thing where, uh, this is hopefully the week you will be coming to find us. Like, why would Michelle know this? Bunny must have been reporting back in some way. Maybe they built it with a telepathic connection or something. I mean, no, it scampered away. It could have gone and seen them. That's what it was doing in between times, and it was, like, bringing me to tutorial puzzles and stuff. Anyway, uh, it feels strange to be writing notes in this temple without that letterhead I ordered when we first arrived from the desk of Carl Eichinger, uh, PhD, was it? Maybe? But all things must come to an end, and office supplies are no exception. Perhaps if you manage to open the world to us again, I can order more. <laughs> He's just thinking about his office supplies. <laughs> Ooh, alright. I got a little blurry as it rotated. So what is up here? A final puzzle. Oh, it's gigantic. Is this a five? It's a six! There's a six! Okay! That's pretty funny. Sixes exist. No. Six exists. <laughs> the end justifies the beans. Okay, this is gonna be something. Um, this might be a joke difficulty. It's entirely possible this is just meant to look intimidating without being an actual, like, super hard final challenge, but I don't know. Could go either way, honestly. But I'm going to give that some time to uh, <laughs> to be solved next time. Might not actually be solved next time, but you know, I'll, I'll give it a try and see how far I get. <laughs> I'll see you then.